Ben Simmons with this Philadelphia 76ers. <laughs> I just, I don't get it. I just don't get it with this guy. Uh, he's, you know, he decides, Hey, you know what? We've had some, we had a really weird off season, but I'll come back. I'll come back. I'll practice. I'll play with the team or whatever. I'll do it. Uh, he comes back and then refuses to participate in drills at practice. Mm-hmm. And he's now been suspended by the 76ers for one game for, t- I think it was conduct detrimental to the team or something. It's always a fun title um, to put, you know? Yeah. Not great. Doesn't look good on the resume. No. Uh, but Joel Embiid wins the day. He's had a very rocky road with Ben Simmons and obviously with two stars on a basketball team. You're usually kind of tied at the hip. Uh, and Joel Embiid comes out and says today, I do not care about that guy. Pretty serious. Yeah. And he also came out and said, not my, great for team chemistry. My no. job here is not to be a babysitter. Uh, not good. Now, from what I've heard, he's not wrong though. He's not wrong. All the reports essentially are that Ben Simmons is a, a kind of a diva, kind of a diva. Uh, he's been babied his whole life. He's been coddled, so to speak. Mm-hmm. Um, so, I mean, at this point, Max, we well, there was a viral tweet today from Sid Sixero, like you know, it's not a great day for Ben Simmons, but I'd still take him on the Raptors if they traded Pascal Siakam. Mm-hmm. Uh, would you like I, at this at this point? How does Philly even? How, how can they even trade this guy? Who Who's looking at all this and say, I want that guy on my team? See, and that's the thing about the NBA, though. We did talk about it a little bit pre-show, right, where it's it's a bit of a different league, right? There's a reason why it's got the reputation of this league, and not saying that in an ignorant way. It's a very fun league to follow with yeah. some of the transactions that occur. But when it comes to Ben Simmons in this situation, it's... <sighs> it's tough to equate to every other sport because it's not quite the same, right? You can do a lot to erode your reputation. You can blow up at practice. You can kind of be a bit of a prima donna and still find a way to net decent trade value because for whatever reason, it's just the way that it is with that league. So I I still look at it. There's probably some suitors out there for Ben Simmons, but again, they're just going to wait until that price is driven to something that the the 76ers can stomach. 